Breaking News Nigerians Butcher's mob killing Sokoto Governor Ali vowed to punish anyone found guilty of making blasphemous comments against Prophet Muhammad. <laughs> In a statement signed by a spokesperson, Abu Bakabawa, the Governor Ali said his administration will not spare anybody found guilty of insulting Prophet Muhammad. Welcome back to Prospects Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you once again. The Sokoto State Governor Ahmed Aliyu has said that his government will not tolerate any abusive action or blasphemous statement against Prophet Muhammad. In a statement signed by his spokesperson, Abubakar Bawa, Governor Liu said his administration will not spare anybody found guilty of insulting Prophet Muhammad. Sahara reporters on Monday reported that Usma Bada was killed in Sokoto, Northwest Nigeria for allegedly blaspheming Prophet Muhammad. The police confirmed that he was rescued or conscious take and taken to hospital where he later died. It was learned that the butcher allegedly made the comment during an argument at the Sokoto main abattoir on Sunday morning. According to Daily Trust, some of Badu's closest closest business partners in the market who made attempts to rescue him were also injured by the estimates and we are receiving medical treatment. Commenting on the incident, the governor urged residents of the state not to take the law into their own hands, particularly we are dealing with blaspheming case. The statement read, the Sokoto state governor Dr. Ahmed Aliyu has called on the people of the state to remain calm and law-abiding at all times. The governor cautioned the peoples against any art capable of degrading the personality of Prophet Muhammad. So, especially in a state like Sokoto, which is a predominantly Muslim-dominated community. Dr. Ali, you said that Sokoto people have so much respect and regard for Prophet Muhammad. So, hence, the need for all the residents to respect, protect his dignity and personality. I want to call on the people of Sokoto State to avoid taking laws into their hands, their own hands, and instead report any alleged crime or blasphemy to the appropriate quarters for necessary action. Our religion does not encourage taking laws into one's hands. So let us try to be good followers of our religion, he appealed. The statement continued. He added that the present administration will not take the issue of blasphemy lightly and will deal decisively with anyone found guilty of any act among amid at the degrading the personality of Prophet Muhammad, the peace be upon him, in line with the provision of Islamic laws. The governor assured the people of the state of his administration's commitment to guarantee the safety of lives and property of law-abiding citizens. The governor also warned would-be troublemakers to have a change of mind, adding that Sokoto is a wrong place for them. Hmm. I pity people who still go to school in the north from south. I can never worship a lazy prophet or God. They must be eager to protect me and fight for me, including themselves. These are reactions from Nigerians. Normally, we are not to be in the same country. And existing as one, Namdekano was right. All this why you can keep humans and zombies in one entity and force them to exist together. Mohammed went not fit fight for himself. 
na mohmat. Let the, the God or prophet fight for himself. Fighting for him means he is powerless. These are reactions from Nigerians and they keep on talking. Governor supporting jungle justice. Allow your God to fight for, your, for yourself. Okay, for himself. This is why I love the Christian God. This is to say they will roast the dead body again. One Nigeria where they are operating to laws. Correct. Anybody, anybody found guilty will be dealt with. Excellency, I am with your idea 100%. Better for people to stop crossing this line border. That is all they all know how to do best, fighting for God, whom they worship as supreme God. Allow supreme being to fight for himself. Muslims are good people, just that some illiterate ones are the ones spoiling their names. Well, I be like what? Okay, guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. When I don't hear the matter, so the Sokoto State Governor Ali have vowed to punish anyone found guilty of making blasphemous comments against Prophet Muhammad. He took this one you know, as one butcher, you know, uh, Buddha. Buddha was killed by, you know, by some estimates saying that he, he, blasphem he blasphemed against Prophet Muhammad. And I still remember how they take killed Deborah, you know, Samuel in this, the same Sokoto state. So now don't hear and so, uh -huh. if you did Sokoto state, stay away from blaspheming Prophet Muhammad. So that your head no will enter. Just just get it and you will be good. Don't blaspheme against Prophet Muhammad. They say then they forbid them. So respect that one for them. Uh -huh. Whether you they talk, say, make their God fight for himself and all that. That will not be the matter. They don't tell you. Stay away from saying anything against their prophet. They will be good with you. If you know you won't be able to do that, stay away from Sokoto State. Simple. If you know you won't be able to keep these laws, come out, leave Sokoto State. That is it. Now, Muslim state be that. If you know, say you're not going to fit, keep their laws, not go there. I beg, make a drop-up for you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please do not forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you.